waiting for an avalanche when you live by the sea. She tilted her head to taste the salt-laced wind. Along the worn, sandy path, the blood-red sunrise caught her by surprise. Container ships rolled on the waves, passing by as masked strangers. Their urgent eyes focused on another horizon. She looked for the Godwits. Had they returned early to the Arctic? The gull fan club soaring, dancing white handkerchiefs in the wind screeched their farewells. She was alone observing the oyster catcher, silently wading in the estuary as the tide turned. Everything looked in its place. She hoped for a red sunset, but in her heart she knew the tiniest bat drying its wing could create an avalanche somewhere in the world.